you know, been doing here in the last couple fights. But look at this damage coming out onto Turret. No fear at all. Look at me, he's gonna tank that one up. He does land the stun out onto Araxi, and he's in deep and will pay for it. So Fiska trying to move backwards as he did have that gauntlet down. BT Lamb dropped that ultimate from deep, but really didn't do too much work. And now we'll see if they want to go ahead and continue this chase. Bashing with the Merciless Pursuit, stun onto Arden. That's not really the target that they want. He's such a tanky hero. And with that, they'll be forced back off at DT Lamb landing a Spitfire, and damage is there. He'll go ahead and clean oh, up that wave. And Bashin, will he take down off this Araxi? Oh my DP goodness! It. Just a moment ago, now more like 3,000, but here comes the initiation from Team Secret. They go for the Hellfire Blue. Look at me, very low on the backside, but he's sticking on a Kvalifar Light Blue. What is PT Lamb hitting right now? The Dragon's Breath way too far away. Palmatoro wants to turn this one around. Mobley jumping on top of him. Kvalifar is taking so much damage from the Kraken, but I don't think it's going to be enough. Sasiska can't go for the kill. PT Lamb goes down, and he is the last member standing. Sasaka, I don't think he's getting away from this. Oh. He gets the return kill. Very cheeky play is coming out of him. But Team C Majestic is the Hellfire Brew to Majestic. And remember, this is a CP. Uh, uh, Ringo as well, that burning damage is going to start adding up, but Pips is now going to be the big target because he's left on the back line. And now Majestic, Palmatar, can he actually lunge into him? Well, he's going to have the Spectral Smite and the Hell's Heart over the edge, and Taisuki-san is not going to be long for this world, but he does have boots. Is this enough? Palmataro has it, and that is an A. ...like that, Arden really just doesn't care, but Kentusik will care, and oh. now All Might's Bite, it will be taken for free. Well, honestly, I'm loving this Roam Black Feather right now. He's able to get up in the front of his team. Look at the damage coming out of Sasika right now. Pete Lamb is there to back it up. The Gauntlet is down. Warhorn activated by Sasika. Oh, man, they, it is a two down right now for Avalanche. It's going to be... Maybe get engagement. Can't find it. But now Snow Tsunami are in a very bad position. They go for the Force to Court. They find two. Kamalafar and Palmatoro are just Ooh. able to fight back, though. Kamalafar, he is going to go down. Mowgli is very low. Palmatoro, he's in a one versus two right now. He's so much damage, oh. he finally goes down. But look oh, at this, Mowgli. the Fade Crystal, Mowgli and the Kraken tag team, and on that one, oh, I don't Mowgli. think Tsunami can he defend gets it. it. They get the Bane Crystal. If they're over 10,000 gold behind, and this, they found the Siska, but will it be enough? They're trying to get the fight, but look at how quickly those health bars get depleted. That's going to be two kills. There's the third, a triple kill for Look At Me on the pedal to finish things off. See this in the overdrive. It's two Siska picking up an overdrive. Oh! oh! Three people over the wall. Papatoro's right in the thick of things, but the first kill actually goes to Kamalfar. He finds PT Lamb. He's kiting backwards. Look at me. Can't get on top of him. This could be a fight for Team Secret. Siska, what just happened? Oh, no.